<laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to another video of the turning test. This is part two, we are doing chapter two of the turning test. Apparently, like every, let me see here, one, two, three, four, six, eight, it looks like ten or eleven. I did not properly count this one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so every, okay, ten or eleven, I'm just gonna stick with that. Totally not failing that, no. But every 10 or 11 is a chapter. What condition um, should I expect so. to find the ground crew in? Daniel this is a very days. easy... Uh, this is a very easy game. But as always, don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Chris is presumably dead. Enjoyed. We are expecting to find Sarah, Mikhail, and Sochi in a stable condition. Chris is dead? He was involved in an accident. Now, I'm just gonna shut up whenever dialogue happens. This game is very easy to do, but it's also very entertaining. Mainly the story part. Okay. Oh. Could we take a more direct way to the ground team? Unfortunately, there is not a direct route. The base is bedded under ice to protect it from the radiation of space. Similar to the Mars base. Similar. Europa's base is slightly deeper into the surface. There is more radiation present from solar events on Mars. But Mars's surface is denser than that of Europa. Now I promise you guys this, I have never played this before. I just am very observant when it comes to seeing things. Oh. Very observant when it comes to seeing things. Oh. Look at that telephone, look at that pole there. I totally recommend you guys to actually download this game, it is very enjoyable to play. I've only been playing it for about 20 minutes now and I'm already on Chapter 2, so it's a fairly short game, but it's very enjoyable to play. The graphics are amazing, it's a pretty good line. Okay, what are their chances of survival here? Oxygen, the food stores, waste management. Everything seems to be in order. There was a small problem with the food store, but the crew fixed that up. We successfully transitioned over to a sustainable small island. Sorry about that, guys. ...artificial ecosystem a year ago, growing fruit and vegetables. It helps boost morale, amongst other things. The crew members could hypothetically survive here for their whole lifetimes. Hypothetically. Let's, let's just go over that. Not that they could, it's hypothetically they could. Can, can I move it? Okay. okay. Oh, okay. So, just going off of what the last one was. Cube go. Cube. Okay, cube. They did an amazing job with the sounds in this game. There's a lot of story in this game. I'm being quiet because I'm trying to think about everything. <laughs> I still gotta make this entertaining for you guys to watch. Especially because of how fast these th videos are gonna be. Chapter chapter one is gonna be like 12 minutes. My purpose as the overseer of this mission is to work for the ISA. I am the ISA's feet and hands. 
distance between Jupiter and Earth make it inappropriate for the ISA to directly interface with the mission directives. As my AI core is stationed on Europa, I can make decisions instantaneously about the running of the base. I mean, there's two ways you can do this. You just come over, walk over here, walk down here, and then put the cube here. I'm not gonna say anything, I totally did not do that. Dang! confusing puzzle. My game just crashed. Okay, good. How does the I seriously ISA thought know it just crashed? The Sorry. Right decisions here when they can't communicate with us. Interestingly, I have a twin on Earth. His name is Michael. The ISA uses my twin to check firmware updates before they upload them to myself. There is a simulation of this mission on Earth, running at all times to check my expert systems. Naturally, as any modern artificial intelligence running on a quantum computer, I also have a large amount of evolutionary algorithms at my disposal. Evolutionary, bro. <laughs> However, they were deemed as too unreliable for general use in the mission. Why is that? Biological systems produce biological results. Messy, unpredictable solutions. Not suitable for such a mission. I can understand how this could be confusing, but I also can't understand how it can be confusing. You know, like right here. That was a little bit confusing, but I understood it after a while. And even then, if I did play this before, I'm not going to remember any of it. Loading. Ooh. Ooh. So... Conversation. I guess. Um, okay, I think you're a robot. No, I'm not. I'm simply not convinced you're a human. I think you might be a robot. I get it. You think I'm a robot? You seem like a robot to me. Your response seemed perfect. 
to me, your responses were fine, suggesting you are a robot. Stop calling me a robot. Yes, yeah, you're definitely a robot. You're definitely annoying. You failed the turning test. You are a robot. I, I'm not in control. True. I am a drone. Yes, you are. I am a robot. Now you're getting it. I'm controlling my programming. I have no free will. Wow. Whatever keys are pressed, it ma makes the difference. It makes no difference. press any key and literally just start typing. Okay, and again? No? Try this again. That's annoying. Leave me alone. What I ever do to you? Did the ISA build you, Tom? As the child of the ISA, I have been given authority aboard this station. I was designed by the ISA and the Ashiyama Corporation, we designed, by the designed in California, assembled in China. But here on Europa, China. I constructed myself. Have you heard of the Turing test, Ava? It's a test to see if a computer can successfully impersonate a human. In the original Turing test, a human judge has two conversations, one with a machine, one with another human. They then judge which of these polite conversations is with a machine and which is with a human. The machine being tested is said to have passed the Turing test if the judge cannot reliably tell which conversation is with a machine and which is with a human. Do you think you'd pass the Turing test? I am quite capable of polite conversation, wouldn't you say? Oh. Okay, that these conversations are weird if that's what you're looking for. That's the light conversation anyways. It's like casually just raise my eyebrows. Sure hope I don't get copyright banned for this music. That would suck. I'm not a dumb IQ of negative 45 person. Okay, so I was right, there are 10 places. <laughs> the Turing test has been criticized. Researchers claim it does not correctly test a machine's ability to think, but rather its ability to deceive. What do you mean? Well, have you heard of the Chinese room thought experiment? Uh, no. Imagine you are in a room. In this room, you are passed Chinese sentences through a slot in the wall. Inside the room is an instruction book written in English. This instruction book tells you which Chinese words to pass back through the slot in the wall as a response. By doing so, you have a conversation in Chinese. That, that actually in the Chinese room, because the responses you pass back through the door are the correct responses, the person on the other side of the door is convinced you are a native Chinese speaker. Well, they're wrong. Perhaps they are not. Because with the instruction book, you are having a conversation. But the person stuck in the Chinese room is not aware of the conversation's content. This is the problem with the Turing test. A computer can pass the Turing test, having convinced a human they are having a polite conversation, while the computer has no idea that a conversation has taken place. What if both of the people passing Chinese words are reading from instruction books? I may be a machine. But I personally do not believe I am stuck inside the Chinese room. Right, you would say that. I could peer inside your databases at any time, Tom. Or pause your operation. Do not assume I could not do the same to you. That's deep.
So I'm guessing, well, not guessing, but I'm seeing that every time they introduce something new, it's always different, so. And it's also always short. This is the crew's quarters. It looks abandoned. Looks like he had two kids. I'm gonna check out these rooms if it lets me. I do not need to see any. It's, ugh, I do not need. I do not see the need for many cameras. Tom's presence everywhere is slightly overpressive. I understand the need for transparency. But why I see it in the toilets? That 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 is a true question. I don't want to want to go to the bathroom and have a robot just staring at me. That would just ooh, ooh, be disturbing. Some nice looking kids. That had some nice kids. Did good, man. You did good. <laughs> it looked like they had fun. Hopefully they're still alive. I'm not trying to push the thing of yeah they all died. Hopefully they still are. What's this? I'm also not trying to push the thing up on my pedo just because I said they were nice looking kids. I'm only saying that because I mean like he did a good job. He has nice kids. Y you know, I'm gonna just shut up. How does this work? I don't even know what that is. Look at that nice little doggo. What? So weird. <laughs> Five, three telemores. Chapter 5 on cells. That's awesome. Whoa, 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 whoa. So I can expect inspect everything here, can I? Does this mean there's something hidden on these things that I'm not seeing? Huh. Oh. Ooh, I like this room. Never mind. One of these got some bleach in it. Just inject bleach. Paint. That's some. That paint is skilled in the art of s pushing upward. It's amazing. We have our next Bob Ross here, kids. Ugh, a lot of reading. March 6, 2249. The whole team experienced nausea during a large electrical surge in Europe, Europe's at, in the Europa's atmosphere. I am concerned this is not an instance of mass hysteria. Vital signs are affected. It, it caused by a uniform surge. By a uniform surge in heart, heart rate that has dedicated all members of the crew. Dedicated. Ugh. I can't read today. I'm reporting to ISA. March 7th, 20, 2249. So, next day. Oh, how long is this going? Okay, I'm not reading all this. If you want to read it, here you go. Pause it. Hold on, I lost my place. So, it was the 16th. There you go. Sorry, I am not. I just don't have the time and the hard drive to record all that. This person really liked needles. It's a dude. Nice. He was a doctor. That would explain it all. Never mind. Woohoo. So biologists, because we care, you get to go to sleep. Is there a dead guy under this? It's very concerning. <laughs> Come on, let me fix it. Ugh, speed cube this again. 
another journal. Okay, if you guys want to read it, go ahead and pause it. I would read this to you guys, but again, time left. Anyone remember that old vine where the girl's playing and then her bow breaks? It was amazing. Look at these. He gets motion sickness. Now that's a well presentable dude right there. Another one! No! Looks like a black hole. Let me just stop for like a few seconds at every one of these so you get to like pause and read it if you want to read it. So this guy did cell research. Plant cells it looks like. virus research. I love how this plant beside me is moving and it's just me moving. <laughs> I love how it says how big the file is under the thing. And uh, here's the end guys. So if you guys read that, props to you. Okay. Loading screen, loading screen, loading screen. <laughs> okay, guys, this is the end of chapter two. Um, thank you all for watching. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, l don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment. Tell me if there's anything I need to change in these videos. Like if uh, I need to get a new mic because I do. I get comments before saying I need a new mic, and I am working on that. I do actually have one. I'm just trying to figure out how to set it all up and wired up so I can still record game sound and not have game sound coming through the microphone. If you guys know how to set up a external mic like that, please go ahead and drop a comment telling me how to do it. And if it works, I will give you a shout out in the next video. Thank you all for watching. Bye.